WABV4 News. Good evening, I'm Pamela Young. Another emotional round of public testimony in the House. It's the third day of discussion on the same-sex marriage bill, and it's expected to last late into the night. KITV4's Nana Okawa joins us with our top story. It's the third day William Talley has bused from Waikiki to the Capitol. He's back in line like many others, anxiously waiting to testify on the same-sex marriage bill. More than 3,000 people have already testified, and there's at least 1,500 more to go. I'm back again here this morning thinking that maybe the line is going to move. Maybe I'll get my testimony and I can go about my business. And here we are waiting again. It's just uh, it's a messed up situation. It's, it's very physically exhausting, but I also am tremendously grateful for the chance to have a voice. I'm tremendously grateful to be able to be heard. The overflowing crowd raised their hands in support of testifiers, showing they are being heard. No one can look at my children. Tell them that they don't deserve the dignity of having their two parents be married. I hope I never have to explain to my children that we are second class citizens. I have the right to follow the dictates of my heart. And my heart tells me that I cannot support a lifestyle that goes against my moral values and against the nature of God. The public hearings have lasted for hours with no immediate end in sight. Organizers say each person who signed up by the October 31st deadline will get the platform to speak. This bill is not about equal rights. It's a privilege. It would be great to be actually married and gain the rights and responsibilities of marriage in Hawaii. The committee will get a break. There'll be no hearing tomorrow, but it'll be back on Monday with most likely another round of testimonies. Pamela, back to you.